we put on protective clothing before we're taken inside a highly secure lab where scientists are creating this year's flu shot. Our equipment sanitized because just one rogue germ could ruin the entire batch. This is really to protect the product and not to protect you. The dilemma for these scientists? The vaccine was only 25% effective against the most common and deadly flu strain last year, H3N2. This year, scientists making a vaccine they hope protects better against H3N2 and the three additional flu strains. It's a guessing game, right? Well, it's, uh, it's, it's like reading the future. We, we look at what has happened over the past months, uh, the, the past flu season, and they make an educated guess on where they think these strains are going. The CDC warning, no matter how effective, everyone still needs to get a flu shot. It is the best way to protect uh, from getting illness, uh, from having to see the doctor, from getting hospitalized, and in kids, it prevents death. The CDC recommends everyone six months and older get the flu vaccine. New this year, the nasal spray version of the vaccine, Flu Mist. The Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices and CDC does not have a preference for taking any one vaccine over the other. So, John, I got my shot today, Excellent. and in announcing it, a few people said, well, you get sick sometimes. What's, what's the deal? Do you get sick from the shot? The flu shot cannot give you the flu. That's the bottom line. But some people might feel like they have a mild cold for a day or two afterwards, but that's nothing like the flu, which will keep you in bed for up to a week. And that mild cold is that people feel is just the immune system ramping up to actually fight off the flu. Feeling fine. Arms a little achy, but otherwise Perfect. Fine. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.